The Wrangler outfit is the 11th of 16 outfits available to purchase from the Trapper in Red Dead Redemption 2. You will need to hunt specific animals that could only be found in specific parts of the map in order to unlock each outfit. For the complete Wrangler set, you will need a perfect pronghorn hide, two perfect goat hides, a perfect sheep hide, a perfect panther pelt, a perfect buck pelt, and a perfect moose pelt. No legendaries today, but would you believe it if I said some of the animals we need to hunt today are even more rare and elusive than those legendaries? It's true, but there's nothing to fear, as I will point out the locations for each animal, as well as the weapons you need to use when hunting them in order to yield a perfect pelt. First, let's get that pronghorn, and there are plenty of them hanging out in this area on the map near Little Creek River. Pronghorns are large-sized animals, so kill one with a regular rifle using standard ammo to get that perfect pronghorn hide. Next up, let's find a goat, which can always be found at this farm here, just north of Van Horn Trading Post. Goats are large-sized animals, so kill it with any rifle using standard ammo to get a perfect goat hide. Similarly, we can find sheep right here in these pens in Valentine. Kill one with any rifle using standard ammo to get its perfect hide. Remember that if you kill any farm animal like goats or sheep, the law may come after you, so be sure to get out of there before they kill you and you lose your hard-earned hide. Let's find that buck next, and I was always able to find them here in the fields just east of Emerald Ranch. Bucks are large-sized animals, so take one out using a regular rifle using standard ammo to get the perfect buck pelt. Next up, let's find that perfect moose, and here's one of those very elusive animals that I was referring to earlier. Moose could be found here at Lake Isabella, and since Lake Isabella is frozen, it might actually be resting on the ice itself, or just beside the ice on the snow. It could also get pretty hard to see in this area, there's kind of a fog effect going on near the water itself, so you really need to look closely with binoculars or your scoped weapon. Eventually, one should pop up as long as you're looking closely. Moose are massive sized animals, so kill it with any sniper rifle using standard ammo to get its perfect pelt. Last but certainly not least, let's find that panther. In my experience, panthers are the rarest non-legendary animals in the game. I searched for well over an hour in areas where panthers are supposed to appear and had none pop up for me. So I ended up having to go to lengths that I never had to go to in any of these other trapper outfit videos. I actually set down some predator bait, three of them to be exact. I set them right beside the water on the east coast of Lagris, just north of St. Denis. And at long last, I turned around and the elusive big cat finally showed its face. Proceed to blow its face off with a rifle using standard ammo to get that perfect panther pelt. But I'm warning you, this one might take a while to actually show up in your game. Once you finally collect all those ingredients, you can go to the trapper, sell all these ingredients to him, and purchase the full Wrangler outfit. If you like this video and want to see more Red Dead Redemption 2 and Red Dead Online guides, secrets, tricks, and more, please hit that like button and subscribe to my channel. I have a ton of fun online-related stuff in the works as that mode continues to evolve and add more content, as well as the rest of these trapper outfit guides. So, look forward to that. Thanks so much for watching, everyone, and take care.